So here is our margarita kit. Margarita, one of the oldest pizza styles in the world from 1889. In this kit, you have three doughs, fresh mozzarella, San Marzano tomato plums, fresh basil, extra virgin olive oil, and some red rock Himalayan salt. Tara is gonna push out a dough for us right now. Look at that. All that style and skill all at the same time. You can go and slap it or you can just do the driving wheel. Well, that's a lot. You can do that at home, that's cool too. We have a pizza palo that we're gonna, or a pizza peel we're gonna put it on first. You wanna get it to around 14 to 15 inches. You might be using a cookie sheet, that's cool too. So once we have it at that point, we're gonna put a little olive oil on it right now before we put uh, the San Marzano tomatoes on. That's gonna protect the crust from the San Marzano tomatoes. And now, we'll take three plums and break them on top. It's a little bit different than a classic margarita, but it's the same in the sense that it's gonna have the San Marzano flesh of the tomato on top of it. Now, at this point, we're gonna take three basil leaves three and you're going to rip them twice. That's going to give you a bunch of leaf parts and we can smell the basil perfume right now. So we'll spread that out and then, oh, there we go. Tara and I will cover the basil with the mozzarella. This is a style of thing we do at Andalini's to prevent the basil from burning. You don't need to use the whole mozzarella ball, but I mean, I like to. At this point, we're gonna take a little bit more extra virgin olive oil and put a little bit more on top. And then red rock salt. You can put this on before or after the bake. Typically we put it on after the bake, but for today we'll put it on right there. Just a little pinch will do you. We'll send this into the oven, cooking it. At the highest temperature your pizza oven can handle around 550 degrees ideally. Once it's golden brown, take that out and it's pizza time. And there we have a gorgeous golden margarita with a little bit of char to it. Nice edging, green mozzarella. It's a little wet if you want to dab it, that's fine, but that's the natural water of the San Marzano tomatoes and some extra virgin olive oil. That's flavor. Want to cut it? Good to go. Have fun with this. Make it in at home and we'll see you soon at the restaurant or just in general. Thank you so much.